stop, set. So the program normally takes one year, but then again, it could take more than that. We work at the speed of the the veteran. Normal pace. Operation Freedom Pause in San Martin is an organization that changes two lives in one team. Veterans get to train their own service dogs. Before I came in the program, I was in a real dark place. I tried suicide a couple times. On the brink of divorce, a psychiatrist recommended Ramon Reyes get a service dog. Through Operation Freedom Pause, Reyes was paired with Huey. I was telling everybody, you know, that same milk chocolate melts in your mouth, not in your hands. This guy melted, <laughs> he melted in my hands. And yeah, and after that, that's my life changed. Step off. Reyes has a traumatic brain injury, so he suffers from dizzy spells or migraines. He'll go up, come next to me on the bed. I tell him, check me out. He starts smelling me, and if he starts licking my right ear, later on in the day, I'm gonna have a migraine. 60% of its brain is dedicated to the sense of smell, and your body is made up of a whole lot of chemistry. So when your chemistry changes, the dog is gonna know it. Mary Cortani is the founder. I am a female veteran from the Vietnam era, and I learned to train dogs in the military. Cortani pulls all of these service or therapy dogs out of rescues or shelters. Watching them grow together in the sense that they have to learn to trust, and that's one of the great gifts. Jeff Wilson has been in the program since 2011. He has PTSD, chronic pain, and mobility issues. So he can hold me up and keep me balanced so I don't fall. Logan is his third service dog. All he wants to do is help and have fun and be in our presence. He's like my little, I, I would call him a shadow, but he's white, so he's like my ghost. I never knew how deep a bond between a person and a dog could be, and I never knew how empowering and how much love that is. Each service dog team would cost around $28,000 to train, but Operation Freedom Paws provides the healing journey for free. In San Martin, Lauren Martinez, ABC7 News.